So my next video will be nutrition for beginners and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. <laughs> <laughs>now guys i just want to say thank you for all the support the comments likes shares that we got on my last videos getting to know who i am i didn't expect it to be honest but you know a lot of people brought more questions to me uh, through private messaging uh, dms on instagram and everything so yeah man it was great that love and support was good man guys and literally whatever i can do all the questions you have keep bringing them in if i don't know like i said i'll get to the right people and they'll be able to answer them for you i'm going to be bringing you my five best exercises i see a lot of people in the gym i get a lot of people coming to me like how do i start the gym what do you do or jeffrey what did you do to be able to get to the size that you're at what i always tell people is stick to the basics that's what matters you know you get a lot of people like hanging off machines in the gym doing dumbbell curls or upside down doing some necks you know back stuff but for me everything that i do is quite basic for the guys that are new to the gym don't look at don't go on youtube and watch a video and then come in the gym and do those advanced exercises stick to your basics build the foundation and then build up from there so guys we'll get straight to it first exercise is the garner man press so that's the bench press okay so that's you laying down on the bench grabbing the bar using the lines that they've set out for you, lowering the bar to your chest and pressing it back up. You know, usually I tell people when you're starting off, put nothing on the bar, lay down on the bench, find your best point, engage your back, you know, kind of uh, squeeze your glutes a little bit, tighten up the core. But usually it's good to have support when you're starting off as well. So if you can get one of the fitness trainers, personal trainers or your friend, uh, or just someone in the gym, ask them politely if they can do it, they will do it. You know, ask them to stand behind you and spot you, you're quite new in the gym. So you just want to be able to see that you can do these exercises. You may, you never know, you may even be able to do this by yourself, but it's always good to, you know, have that safety person there. Whenever you can, just top up the bar, maybe start off with a 2.5. Don't feel shy, remember, it's your safety first and it's you that's growing. So there's no need to go and put 15s to 20s if you're not capable of doing it or if you haven't tried it before. Only you will get hurt and you'll be at the game as quick as you come in. Second exercise is the Garner Man Rolls. So that's you, knee slightly bent, glutes tight, tilt forward at the hips and literally rowing the bar up, okay? So there, dropping the dumbbells down and literally rowing it up. Third exercise is the Garner Man Curls. So that's grabbing two dumbbells, seated as well, so you, there's no swinging movements in it, and curling the dumbbells up, squeezing the biceps, and back down. That's curling the dumbbells up, squeezing the biceps, and back down. And I like seated because when you're standing, you get a lot of movement in the exercise. And again, because of that, some people like to go heavy, whereby they can swing their weight up, just to get that momentum to get the weight up, but you don't want to do that when you're starting off. Just something very light. Even myself, when I go in the gym and I start biceps, I usually grab an eight kg, eight to 10 kg, and do 20 reps of that, seated, very slow. Every time you get to the top, don't lock it all the way to the top. Just a little bit away from the top and literally squeeze the biceps, you know, one to two second holds all the way back down flex it all the way back up and extend it all the way back down. That will give you a nice pump in the muscles. You will also get uh, that lactic acid burning sensation in the muscles as well. So as I said, you don't need to go too heavy. Throughout the whole movement, you wanna keep your elbows literally locked in one place so it's not moving up and down. It's literally just that little bit higher than um, your back and then go from there. You don't want to get no movements in your shoulders. It's easy to bring your shoulders and other muscles into this type of workout. Next is the Garner Man Shoulder Arnold Press. Don't worry about the Arnold bit. It's the Garner Man Shoulder Press, okay? So from here, we've got the palms facing you, okay? And as we're pressing, we start to tilt and open up our arms and press up in the air. A little bit more advanced than your standard shoulder press from the side, but it does include about four or five muscles that you're working in one go. That's your, four, that's your forearms, that's your um, triceps, um, traps. So 
and obviously your shoulder muscles as well. So you're getting a lot of movements and a lot of muscles working at the same time. My fifth exercise is the Ghana triceps kickback. So this is where you're slightly bent in your knees and again, tilt right forward, okay? And your elbows just slightly more, um, slightly above your back. Lock it there and literally flexing your arms backwards with two dumbbells in your arms, okay? And bringing it back in and so extending it back in, flexing it back out, flexing it back out backwards and then literally bringing your arm back in. So as you know, triceps support a lot of muscle groups such as your shoulders and such as your chest. Knees slightly bent, glutes tight, tilt forward at the hips, elbows higher than your back, locked and literally flex open the um, elbows. So kicking the arms back, squeeze the triceps, allowing it to come back in, extend it back in again, and literally flex it back out, squeezing the triceps and allowing it to come back in, guys. So that's my five basic exercises for beginners in the gym. As we move on and as we progress in our videos, I wanna see what you guys come back with and what you think of this. If you guys think that this does help you in the gym as you're starting off, or even if you are in the gym, if you think, you know what, I need to actually go back to basics and see what Big Black Garner Man is doing and what helped him to build up, please let me know and I'll go from there. And then obviously that will help me to make my second video or the more advanced video to this. Stay tuned, keep your questions coming in and let me know if there's anything more you'd like to see in the videos. So my next video will be nutrition for beginners and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. And also guys, for my last competition, thank you to everybody who supported, everybody that was there, the team, we smashed it, we did what we could and yeah, next year we definitely, definitely, definitely got a better physique coming and we got a lot, a lot more entertainment for you guys. And be safe in the gym. If you don't know, make sure you ask somebody. There's a lot of personal trainers there and they're there for a reason. Go to them and make sure you're asking them about the right stuff to do. If not, come and look at Big Black Garden Man's video. I've got time for everybody, guys. So yeah, man, stay tuned and then we'll go from there.